So I save all my water as well, so you can see there's barrels up there. I just put those up. i got to put some uh, screens on top so the mosquitoes don't start, start getting in there. It's a very simple thing. And uh, here's one of our barrels. You can see what they like. You just... Compost barrel. Yeah. So sure. That's a much better idea. Than so that's uh, yeah. we developed for that one. And then we yeah. have a more. Uh, I have an illegal building here. Didn't do it. Have to take a picture of this for for dash. Very good. Amazing. Excellent. So here, uh, this is another water catchment system. Uh, you can find this out now. The water catch? Well, yeah, because then, uh, right. why uh, use all city water when you get all this stuff here, you know? So this is, again, one of my compost buildings. So this one here we're going to make into a straw bale building. And this will become my methane digester in here. And uh, <laughs> the building size was okay to not have to have a building permit. But then uh, I put it too close to this building, so I have to go talk to them. At this point, they're saying, Matt, just make sure it's well hidden. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'd rather just get it out in the open. <laughs> we'll make this a straw bale and put it. Edit that part out. <laughs> so, and doing That's all kinds of things. There's more stuff. Oh, well, let's go inside the building. Uh, we have a lot of people who are going to be very interested in what you're doing here. Well, yeah, I remember I don't have all the answers. And, uh, well, no, you have a lot more than most. So. So what what kind of press is this? Uh, oh. This is a, a, a sun uh, an oil, oil, oil press. press oil press yeah. So this one we do uh, food grade stuff. We do hemp oil and we do uh, sunflower oil and things like that. Mm -hmm. So it really works uh, rather well. I have uh, operators who come in and help out with it all. There's uh, you have to start this by hand. You know so it's, it's, mm -hmm. you can see what the whole process is. Mm -hmm. Now, if someone wanted to park uh, park an, uh, an RV in your driveway and, and uh, hang out and hang out with you for a while, what would you say to that? Fine. Great. <laughs> <laughs> I got an RV already. Right. <laughs> I have to have an RV as well. Yeah. So that's one press. That's a food grade press, and we're just mounting that on a trailer so we can take that out to various farmers who want to do organic stuff now. So we're going to put that in a trailer, and unfortunately, I put a single cylinder engine. The thing bounces like this. So we got some problems to solve there. This one here. Um, was my first press, and we do a lot of fuel grade stuff here. Um, it's not it's obviously not together here, but uh, we run. That's a, an old Lister, about 1950s Lister. I found, mm -hmm. which actually found me, and it works fantastically well. It, it burns sunflower oil. It's, I think this one actually runs off right now. Show you what it's like. Start. Need some heat. <laughs> that one needs some wow. heat. Holy shit. 